From SNK Playmore comes the PlayStation Mini version of Prehistoric Isle. For those of you who like your islands filled with dinosaurs, cavemen, and insane amounts of challenge. Prehistoric Isle is a 1989 side-scrolling airplane shoot-'em-up, and a really good one that a lot of people are probably not familiar with. It's got some good music, great action, and fantastic art design. Bombing cavemen never gets old. The good news here is that, as an affordable download from PlayStation Network, this will work on your PlayStation 3 and PSP. On the downside, you can't play two-player, even though it kind of looks like you can. You can. But you can shoot and bomb cavemen. Cavemen! Who will jump up and grab your airplane if they're not destroyed. I think it's safe to say that Prehistoric Isle was inspired a bit by R-Type. You have the rotating shooting orb device, and it's a bit of a slow and lumbering side-scrolling shooter. One with some really chunky visuals that should definitely appeal to the SNK fans out there. I uh, rather enjoy this game, and it totally represents SNK's arcade heritage, because it starts off easy and it's fun and gets you into the game and then just crushes you, but you're so happy to be playing it, you'll continue to plug quarters into it. Uh, unless you have this version, in which case it's just a, a one-time marginal fee and you're good to go. You know, these days, zombies seem to be the enemy of choice. They're in, like, thousands of video games. We need to bring back games with more dinosaurs, especially ones with big, sharp, pointy teeth that try to grab your airplane and eat you. Prehistoric Isle also has a nice collection of dinosaurs in the game, so you could learn a few things, like paleontology and how to destroy dinosaurs with an airplane. But I should warn you, the one thing that you really want to watch out for in this game is getting blown up. Because then you lose your speed and weapon power-ups, and then you're pretty much screwed. Especially after this level, the game just goes nuts. Thank, thank you, that was, that was nice of you, Allosaurus. Just imagine the amount of research the designers had to do in order to realistically recreate all of the dinosaurs in this game. I wonder if they had to go back in time and study real dinosaurs to make sure they got the motion and the sound effects just right. You can't just, you can't just make this stuff up. I think SNK went back in time. And um, if, if you do it again, change change things so that we're on the Neo Geo 8 by now, with 4D graphics and a cup holder. Yes, you shoot the flying bat things and the cavemen fall to their doom. I love this game. Really, this, this is the way video games should be made. Prehistoric Isle. It's got fabulous visuals, outstanding music, realism, and you can carpet bomb dolphins. Download this game today before we're all wiped out by a giant asteroid, and then people of the future, who may not even be people, they may be cockroaches with thumbs, will be playing Prehistoric Isle 2, where they'll be carpet bombing humans sitting on couches playing video games, like this one. Prehistoric Isle, take that, cavemen!